So now I'm going to show you how to change the oil uh, in the automatic transmission. Uh, this is not a full oil change for this car. This is basically just a, a flush um, or just a small change, a three quart change. So the oil plug is uh, right here which is right next to the catalytic converter the second one and this is the uh, flywheel cover plate and it's a uh, pretty big bolt 24 millimeters I had to buy a uh, wrench special just for this job and you want to put your pan somewhat um, a little bit farther away because it's going to kind of squirt out pretty far so I kind of put it there and then you can move it in uh, as it comes slows down a little bit uh, so this is going to empty about uh, three to four quarts and uh, so I'm going to go ahead and loosen it and empty it out again it's not on there very tight And there is a washer on there, so again, I'm going to try to grab it. And it just made it. Alright. Now your fluid should look nice and um, red like this. If you're getting brown, uh, brown oil, then you probably want to do a full flush on the transmission. Um, in this case, this is, uh, I do this every time I change the oil. And uh, this keeps the fluid nice and fresh the whole time. And I just can do these three quart changes every time. So I know that this transmission was perfectly filled up before, so I want to put in the same amount that I took out of it. Uh, so in the car, this is the uh, automatic transmission dipstick. And uh, it's kind of got two sides to it. Um, one side is for when the transmission is cold and the other side is when the transmission is hot. But we won't worry about that right now. So basically what we're going to do is just put the uh, new oil in uh, right from there, right into that. So here's my funnel, there's my fluid, and uh, that's it. I just do one quart at a time. I put the new quart in and then I empty a quart out of my bucket and then put in another new quart and then empty another quart out and then uh, I'll measure that last uh, third quart and see how full I get it and then I'll put in that same amount of new oil into it. So this is my uh, last quart of filling it up and I can see on this gauge the air that it's almost a full um, liter of fluid so I almost got a full three quarts out of it. Uh, here's a brand new one. Not sure if you can see it, but it's just a hair taller. But um, I don't think this much fluid is going to make that much difference. So I'm just going to put in the whole quart. Uh, so for this change, uh, you took out exact, a little under three quarts and I'm putting in uh, three quarts of fluid into the automatic transmission.